Haitian peasants have struggled to establish a peasant economy and to resist forces urging them towards plantation wage labor. The rural communities imagine a new political and social order capable of offering them the space needed to reconstruct their lives as communities who have suffered and vowed to never again suffer the racism, the terror, and the constant violence of the plantation system. They wanted to build their own identity and their struggles for equality. Land ownership was the basis of economic freedom, but also a matter of dignity and power. This is the cultural source of the spiritual strength, resistance, imagination, and creativity for all of us. This is Haiti. It is a matter of justice to invest in the rural areas with the smallholder farmers, like we do at Foucault, and keep alive what remains of our rural community. Justice for the population whose back-breaking coffee production paid the indemnity, the debt and the double debt contracted by force in 1825 to compensate the colonial slave owners while maintaining those vital populations in the margins. Our own experience at Focal, though limited, is a continuous transformative process of learning, listening, sharing that works both ways. We support their resistance, the fight against food insecurity, the promotion of local production, the preservation of our biodiversity, and the protection of the environment can gain momentum only through long-term investments and respect for the leadership of the small farmers' organizations. What I invoke with you is the real spirit of Haiti, that of freedom, of solidarity among and with those who suffer, of mutual understanding and of honest commitment, the spirit of resistance the spirit that can enlighten our path, and as said by the great poet Aimé Césaire, give us the strength to look at tomorrow. La force de regarder demain, force pour nous garder demain. <laughs>